Right. So you hid under there? Uh-huh. And what was it like when this came through? Uh, I was holding my dog. I was sitting on the stool holding my dog. This was the game plan all through the years, uh, you know, to go in that little bathroom. And uh, the electric never went off because the electric went off in the bathroom about the same time I felt the stool come up out of the floor. And I rolled around a little bit and when it stopped, I was right there, that presto cooker is what I saw. You were lying there in the uh -huh. rubble. And I never lost consciousness. Uh, and I hollered for my little dog and he didn't answer or didn't come. So I know he's in here somewhere. Uh -huh. But uh, it just, I mean, it, it was there and it was gone. Just, uh, just no time. And uh, then it was light. And I thought, well, I'm okay. And I had some stuff on top of me and I started wiggling. Are you able to comprehend yet what happened here? I know exactly what happened here. Exactly. And uh, what do you, I mean, what do you, what do you think of all this? This is your neighborhood. I can't imagine. This is life in the big city. The dog, the dog. The dog. Hi, puppy. The dog. Oh, oh, Fuzzy. Oh, Fuzzy. Bless your little bitty heart. Help me. Help Megan. Oh, Fuzzy. Oh, 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 oh. Come on, get him. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Well, I thought God just answered one prayer to let me be okay. He answered both of them. Because this was my life, my second prayer. Poor little thing. Poor little I'm so glad.